Sister, I've done as you asked. Bless you. But it's not sister. It's Mother Superior. Mother Superior Calderon. Our bishop was a stickler for regulations. <laughs> Until he got sick last week and ate half of the cathedral choir boys. I'm sorry. I only mention it because my girls are laughing at you calling me sister. What do you think is causing all this? Hmm. Déjame ver. Mexico is an old country. Many faiths have lived and died here. Many evil spirits have flourished. I have no idea what is afflicting the people here. But I know it is a sickness of the soul. Something supernatural, maybe. Certainly nothing rational. Perhaps if you were to get me alive one of these creatures, we could try a couple of experiments. Certainly. Get me a new one. One who was recently human. I want to work with a subject who has only recently turned. I'll see what I can find for you. Gracias, señor. <laughs> Cállense. No puedo creer cómo se portan. Mother Superior, I think I have a test case for you. Senor Marston, you're a true pilgrim. That I ain't. Hmm. Now let's see. <laughs> well, it certainly isn't the flu. Their eyes are so devoid of love, of, of anything. <laughs> oh, lively one I see. Here. What is that? Holy water. I think we may have something. It seems to be working. Maybe. Maybe not. But it seems as if you were nearly saved. Spiritual infections are confusing things, Senor Marston. None of us can hope to understand them properly. But he came back for a minute. I bless the water, but perhaps my faith is not that strong. I have to do more thinking, but I need time. Every day, more of my people fall as the dead rise in Sepulcro. Then perhaps it's time I put them to rest. Take the holy water. Maybe it will be a calming balm for the restless departed. Thank you. No, thank you. You are a blessing in an unusual form.
must be crazy. Go! 